All right, let's first begin with the top story. It will be the biggest transition in Congress, Vice President Rahul Gandhi's eventful career. Highly placed sources have now told our sister publication Mail Today that on the 17th of this month at the AICC session in Delhi, Rahul Gandhi will be projected as the ace and soul of the Congress campaign. Uh, Rahul Gandhi is slated to uh, own up to achievements and failures of the Congress party over the past nine years. A section of the Congress feels, however, that he should not be declared the Prime Ministerial candidate, among them Big Vijay Singh, who spoke earlier to headlights today. Uh, they also feel that the political climate is hostile and a defeat would be extremely humiliating for the Gandhi family grandson. However, there's another section that believes that Rahul Gandhi needs to be projected right now because in absence of a clear message on leadership, Congress may suffer at the hostings. Sources also revealed that the Congress is now busy shoring up Rahul's image through the AICC session and will take up issues that are close to the masses. Let me quickly go across to our political editor, Kartike Sharma. Kartike, there were leaders like Digvijay Singh who had expressed their apprehension about uh, naming Rahul Gandhi as the prime ministerial nominee. But does it appear that the die is now cast? You see, two things are happening. One, you, they have to take a final call on the nomenclature. For example, all uh, the in Indian Women Congress uh, was supposed to uh, uh, pilot a resolution saying that Rahul Gandhi should be the prime minister candidate. Now, uh, the president of the Indian Women Congress has been told not to do so. That was the first indication that the problem on the nomenclature is there. Second indication is that the Rahul Gandhi will be projected as the face and soul of the campaign. There is no doubt about it. He will be the leader. If you look at the posters, you'll only find a picture of Rahul Gandhi on it, not Sonia and Manmohan Singh. So what the party wants to do is, while doing the projection of Rahul as the supreme leader under whose umbrella the election will be fought, they are perhaps thinking again as to uh, will it be correct on their part to say that he will be the prime minister candidate i know it's a very hair splitting uh, argument which is happening within the congress party but that's what we reported uh, yesterday that uh, there is a section who feels that you can say everything without actually naming him the prime minister candidate uh, I, and these are the fine nuances or the, the, the issues of nomenclature the whole debate is still on uh, I would say that they have not taken a final call on this issue. But then uh, the most significant, uh, I would say, indication is that Indian uh, Women Congress has been asked not to pilot that resolution. But nonetheless, his supremacy uh, within the system would be established. The other side to this, of course, Karthike, is that as the lead campaigner for the Congress in this election, he already heads uh, the campaign committee, for example, uh, if he doesn't step up for th this time, to lead the con Congress in what is a, 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 real, uh, a real difficult moment uh, for the party, uh, he will be seen as once again shirking his uh, responsibilities. Uh, you know, uh, I, I agree with you. You know, that's, that's the reason why that there is such a deep uh, dilemma within the Congress party as to what to do about it. And there, is, there are two things to it. One, uh, the organizational role of Rahul Gandhi is very clear. But what, what the party feel needs to be done is that he has to be projected as the leader, not one of the leaders. You see, the projection of Rahul Gandhi in 2009 was one of the trinity. What is required right now is, with the party feel, is that it has to be an unambiguous message that he is our leader, we will fight under him, and this will continue. The issue is the nomenclature which we have, which we have reported, yeah. how, to, how to redefine Rahul's role without trapping him into that little word. Now, some feel that it becomes the uh, face-off, but others feel that he cannot run away and feel that, you know, in UP, when Congress didn't announce him as the clear candidate, uh, the people didn't vote for the Congress party despite the despite high turnout of people. And Mulayam Singh came back to power. So these are the nitty-gritties which will evolve in the next two days. All right, Kartike, we'll wait for uh, more events out of the Congress uh, Committee headquarters. Of course, they're uh, meeting today to begin drafting uh, that uh, manifesto for the elections. Thanks for getting us those perspectives early up.